um, worldviews help open our eyes to some things and they blind us to other things. Աշխար խայացքները մեր աչքերը բացում են որոշ բաների եւ մեզ կուրացնում են մեկ այլ բաների։ շատ հաճախ ինչ որ բան որ ընդունված է որոշակի աշխարհայացք ունեցող մարդկանց։ It's not really pleasing to God. Իրականում աստուն այդքան էլ հաճելի չէ։ Um we were on the island of Cyprus one time. Մի անգամ Կիպրոս ենք գնացել։ We have a whole bus of missionaries. Միսոնարներ մի ավտոբուս է մեր։ The airport is on one end of Cyprus, we're supposed to go to the other end of Cyprus. Արապորտը Կիպրոսի ես մի ծերում է, պետի մյուս ծայրը գնային։ For a conference. Մեր կոնֆերանսի համար։ So they decided to hire a guy մի մեկ են բարձել են մեր դրայվեր ն գայ գիտուն են ինձ վարա tell us all the legends of cyprus ո գիտեմ մեր կիպրոսի բոլոր լեգենդները պետք է պատմեն didn't realize that we were missionaries ան չի դար որ որ մենք միսիոներն ենք and we're driving along գնում ենք basically every possible biblical person in the new testament lived at some time on cyprus ա ան բոլոր մարտիկական ասած ես չու նոր կտարանում կիպրոսում կիպրոսում են եղել ու իր ասերը ոնց որ կիպրոսում են թաղվել են you know armenians start up the wheel ոնց որ հայրը կալիս ունեն բանալ է հայտ նա բերել who's not in the bible հետո մեկին է հասնում որ ասած է կիպրոսի հերոսներից մեկը our guide was russian մեր գիտը ռուս էր but he spoke english but it's անգլերեն and շատ լավ էր խոսել he lived down south for a long time Okay, person shall jam on a kid up. And he was talking about this guy. Oh, Jose Maria smart to us. And he made a comment about the guy that revealed the guy's world view. Uh, uh the guy said something that showed me what his world view was. Ah, mi bana ses koras vistovets te vorne ir ashkharhayatska. He said this man as a size smart ka as is as it should be. Ronts el pet kelini. Had one wife and three lovers. Mi kinuner yev uner yerek siretsyar. And he just went on Vasla his world you said it ashrayts kasum er you have a wife for children the king una serakh ekit ha er bel multiple lovers una si siratsner for fun ha vesi hama and he thought that was very normal when kum tatsum or dalari normal er there may be moral things like that in armenia karo en manati baner bajen a hayastanum ha astotash but generally accepts that you can do this but antan or amal tugats oras inch banak karo es antas i have a friend that works with gypsies men gerona vor ukrainanum ashkhatum er ginchuneri het and he said then i want to tell you something you probably don't know dano mosum asen vor chigidat tavanapar the gypsies that i work with ginchuneri unet ashkhatum er believe avatum er that Abraham appeared to one of their ancestors. Abraham հայտնվել է իրենց նախնիներից մեկին։ And he told this ancestor. Եվ այս նախնիներից մեկին ասել։ The gypsies are all poor. Դու գնչուները բոլոր տաղքապես։ It's okay if you steal. Նորմալ է թե գողանա։ And so they don't think stealing is a problem. Այսինքն ես չեմ մտածում որ գողանալը խնդիր է։ Because Abraham said they could steal. Դա Աբրահամը ասաց չեն գողանալ գողանալ։ Ուկրաինան ուկրաինացիները չեն կարող պես գնչուներ։ And that gypsy group at least that uh that was a real problem yeah so much because the world view the see but over that it ends our hearts can help them and it's our world views also shape our lives mer ashkar hayats knen en nar zavorum er mer kyanka we're not always consistent with our world views men mish chenk kayun hamapatasman mahut mer ashkar hayats ki hai believe god exists մարդիկ հավատում են ասոգոյությունը but they live as practical atheists բայց պրակտիկ առնում որպես ատեիստ են they live as if god doesn't exist ապրում են ասես թե աստված գոյություն but they do it shapes what we think what we feel մեր հավատքը ինչ որ զգում ենք ինչ որ անում ենք ինչ որ ասում ենք այդ ամենի վրա ազդեցությունը you have subculture element subculture world you have practice and you have general culture մենք մանթանոր մշակույթային աշխարհացքը եւ ենթամշակույթային um Sunday I just yeah, started, uh, and I'm not criticizing this was just something I noticed okay. your church likes to hug hug mm -hmm. Ukrainians don't hug like that and I'm, I'm sitting there and I'm going huh? 
That sister just hugged David. And she kissed him on the cheek. And I know that's not his wife. In Ukrainian builders, you don't do that. Men kiss men, women kiss women. And I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. But it's just like, this is different. Now, in general, do Armenians hug? Or is that a church? We do. Okay. Now, um, and we'll see, but, uh, I can get with David. Okay, David, shake my hand. You're not, you're not Ukrainian. You're not Ukrainian. If you're Ukrainian, you would have gone mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. That's their hug. Mm -hmm. right? And if I hug, if I shake hands, you shake hands like mm -hmm. the American. That's mm -hmm. your hug. But if I shake a Ukrainian's hand like yeah, that, they think I'm not a real man. It doesn't it's not you got to ram it all the way back and squeeze as hard as you can. Did you notice that when you were in Ukraine, David? As God said it for Ukraine, I that you have to shake hands like this. They don't hug a lot. And I've been living in, in Ukraine for a while. If you go into a group of men, it doesn't matter, Christians and non-Christians, when you arrive where that group is, you have to shake every man's hand. When you get ready to leave, you shake every man's hand. And apparently you go, bye. Bye. bye. bye. And so there's this group of young guys. And when I lived in America, uh, I was their basketball coach. And my sons and I walk up and... I just remembered we're in America. Well, all these guys, 17, 18 year old. My friend, my, my son, she was And the And I'm walking around shaking each one of them's hand. And my oldest son looks at me as we're getting the car. And he says, Why are you shaking my hand? Dad, you're in America. Dad, you're in America. And I'm like, Dad, you're in America. Did you look at their faces? Yes, them kids. That was really weird for them. They couldn't figure out why you were shaking their hands. Different cultures, different practices. What's considered normal in one is not considered normal in another. Now, when I first went to Belarus, you know, tradition, you know, on the cheek, that's cool. I didn't like the tradition in the churches of the Baptist of the old men. Old men? Mm -hmm. uh, Baptist of the old. Yeah, they, these old, old Baptists. Uh, uh, Baptist. They didn't want to kiss me here. They wanted to kiss me right on the mouth. And I was like, <laughs> don't do that. That's that's my yeah. wife who's there, but you don't go there. But to them, that was very normal. So I had to develop a tactic. They're coming in and I switch my face and hit them. I have a question. <laughs> well, what's the holy kiss? So what do they mean in the first church by the holy kiss? I cannot tell you where they kiss. Where it had much the same meaning as you guys do. But it was a way of greeting. And greeting more and more. Yeah, uh, it, was a, it was a symbol, it became a symbol of fellowship. I think that I've never seen my brother, brother uh, here, I've seen or, or yes, no, I don't see her lips. I haven't invested in that. Uh, sure that. uh, uh, that's what it was. Um, it develops over time. So those are just some of the characteristics of a world. In any society, a person's there there are there's a general way of looking at life. But in right. the subgroups, there are variations of that worldview. Occasionally there are very radical groups. Uh and their and their very different. Yeah, we don't have but most people have 
some type of version of that general worldview. What version Depends on the knowledge. It depends on the problems that that individual or that subgroup of It depends on what context they live in. Um, in Armenia, how, in terms of the way they see life, uh, how are city people different than rural people? People who live in big cities versus people who live in big cities. Besides, other than the fact that country people milk cows and goats, but how do they see the world? How do they see the world? How do they see the world? How do they see the They're less official with each other in the village. Less official in the village. I know. Less uh, more hospitable. Okay. And, and more uh, hospitable in the country than the Yeah, and, and more honest, generally. Mm -hmm. You're more honest because people know what you do. Sometimes I don't know if this is on in Armenia. I don't know if this is on in Armenia. Some places in some places in some places in some places in some places in some places in some places in some Sometimes city people task of what you do and our children come short with the honest and rural people relationships not always and city and country people living in the city country people rural people meaning people from a village to come to the city they have a lot of tension sometimes they they will say city people are just so cold they're not friendly. They don't ever invite me over to their house. And city people that move to the country will go. All these people keep dropping by my house. I'm invited. And they sit here for hours. Let me ask you this. In Armenia, the city people and country people knew and relate to time differently. When you go to the village, do you tell them in advance, I will come at this time? Or you, do you just say, well, I'll be there in the first half of the day, the second half of the day? Or do you say, I'll be here at 10 o'clock? Tell us, Mr. Jama, that's in time. They kind of know, like, yeah, they don't know specifically. As soon as 3, I'm going to be there. So they don't expect me at 12 o'clock. Mm -hmm. How many hours did you spend there last Saturday? I'm going to say, you were there from two to ten. I had six minutes of dance. Around ten hours. Around ten hours. Would people in the city have given you ten hours? How could you have worked as a jam at time? No, because they're thinking but schedules, work schedule. Courts are gone. Among missionaries, or is that name? Uh, there used to be the idea of Africa time. Africa can show when I got to ask what's all it's in car. They would never say, I don't care if I change now. See, church will start at this time. Yeah, I can't see a cinch. I show me now. This was before a lot of technology. The technology, it's all that shady. Hard to go. So, when did church begin? Yeah, pretty good. Whenever I got to start, it's in school. Whenever I got to go to the same. When did it end? Yeah, pervert channel. Nobody knew. They just keep going. And the first the missionaries from America were like, we should have started, you know, like an hour ago. Yeah. Okay. 
There's also student time. Which includes the idea always has to let us out for break on time. I love when I'm teaching a bigger group. There will always be one perfectionist, one pedantist in the group. Everybody else, especially the third day of the fourth day. They're coming back five minutes late, ten minutes late. And that guy is already sitting in his chair, and he's mad at everybody else. He's like, it was time to start. Now, by the time he gets to the fourth course, he doesn't care. He doesn't care? He doesn't care. Because he's never going to change him. So decide, how much do I want to fight that mentality that we have that would get a little bad because 40 people would coming in with me every break would take about two hours so you just have to deal with some of these things Okay. So these things, you know, um, people just take these, they just take for granted these assumptions about reality. They very seldom critically evaluate these. But they're usually connected to very deep feelings. Life really is this way. And my grandma said it was that way. And my mom said it was that way. And my friend said it's that way. And when you present an idea that's radically different, you're just crazy. Why are you saying this? Life is not that way. And so, you have to take these things that you have to do with people. I mean, talked about the world views are kind of like glasses or sunglasses. They're the lenses through which you see the world. And, you know, I can take off these glasses. I can put on the glasses. That's not hard. But worldviews don't work like that. It's as if they're glued to my head. And you're wanting me to take them off. Yeah, do some of this. You can't find them. You need to think differently. Or you should get from the other side. You have solve solve all day in my mind. So we come. So we come to people. I make my mind clear. It's not about guns, not. Um, like your people in the village. Religion hasn't probably hasn't played much of a role in their life. Nobody's really told them about Jesus in the past. You're you're opening their eyes. And, and, and right now it's exciting to them. But there could be a point in which they go. Oh. If this is true, then yeah, I have to this. doing this. Yes, doing this. And then you're like, oh. hmm. sometimes it's really hard. Um, we have a young couple in the church in Poland. Ukrainian refugees. And in Ukraine, Ukraine. Uh, their world, you said, um, living together and having sex before marriage is normal. normal. They moved to Poland. It happens in Poland, but the Catholic culture, but you just don't admit this is happening. Some of the people in our church started sharing the gospel with her and with him. They both got saved. Yeah, problem. 
Jeden chrán týdne. They now know that sex before marriage is wrong. Keď tam zárať sex v láte, je vyrežať a opredné v láte. But they don't have the money to rent another apartment. Nepráci, jeden čune na etkán kumaru, pezi uriš, uh, uriš tún v láte. So, Asinkan. what are you going to do with them? Inč, inč He said, I want to be baptized. He said, I want to be baptized. He said, not as long as you're having sex outside of marriage. I'm not going to do that. He said, okay, we'll stop having sex. But I can't leave out right now. Because we don't have the money for another partner. We said, okay, then go ahead and get married. Hmm. Hmm. Polish law will not let Ukrainian refugees get married without waiting six months. Do you see the problem? They're willing to get married. The government won't let them officially in the eye of the government. Uh, at the car of so, what I came back with, don't take any drugs until I'm married. Well, well, well, well, well, at the very least, you guys need to have a church wedding. Become a couple in the eyes of God. And already file documents so that in six months your marriage can be done. Then you have to make this relationship right before God. In a typical setting, I would never advise anybody. And transitioning from one worldview to another, um, I'm with a man from Africa. Um, and we were talking one day. He said, Dan, you were a pastor before, right? He said, I want to discuss an issue with you. And I want you to tell me if, if you think, uh, if I'm giving people the right advice. And he brought up an issue that I had never had to deal with before. Polygamy is still legal and normal in his country. He said, we, we evangelize people. My husband in the family comes to faith. He starts growing spiritually. And he asks, I see in the Bible that I'm only supposed to have one wife. What do I do? I've got four. Four sat on my first missionaries. <laughs> really, but uh, the first missionary said, You pick your favorite one, she stays your wife, and you just or making it through mass, and Manatas in Dusan. The only problem is, no other man will yeah. have those wives because they were already wives of with those women because they were wives of a man already. If there's no man in a woman's life, it's a village culture. You're either a wife or you're a prostitute. For, for women in his culture. So when the first missionary said you have to get rid of all of them except one, they basically knew those women to be prostitutes. Yes, There's a second option we have. We say keep all four. But right. you need to treat three of them like sisters. But hey, get it here at Barbara's of the school. You don't set their pecs sex of chess. Take care of them and their children. But hope that you don't have more than one section of your wife. You only more sense. Let's see, make in for all my normal. You're just like your relatives. Okay, now I'm an armor. I'm not a terrific cobotic. I'm not. Okay. See, love. 
He said there's a third option. I'm like, okay. He said, we tell the man. Say, Paul told you. Whatever condition you're in when you're safe, stay in that condition. If you're a slave, stay asleep. You are in polygamy. So you can keep all your wives. You have to teach your sons and daughters that this is not normal. And your generation has to be the last generation that practices belief. Since you wound up in this situation, you can live with them all till you die and they die. But What would you have told? if they just, just chose one and then ditched all the rest mm -hmm. so, so what about those who he ditched because they have this needs to have husband uh, it's it's uh, in the so it's like the, the Bible says that we should uh you know satisfy them sexually also it's gonna be that like my most favorite and, uh, they're gonna say like what their quest do to my husband your quest win their lives basically. Yeah. Would you agree with him, David, or what option would you have? I uh, uh, he's in a course, so he didn't listen at fully. Yeah, if, if there's a time for you to repeat, I can oh. tell, but uh, I, I heard Basically, how. in that situation, I did have a checking match. There's not an ideal option. Each option has its problems. And you want to move people towards God's ideal. But um, so that when we're moving from one, remember we talked about repentance being a change of thinking. Is a radical change in your worldview. Paul says, Before I view Christ, Christ as a human person, but yes, all thought persecuting Christians was normal. But he gets saved and he goes from being a persecutor to being a persecutor. Talk about a radical worldview shift. And sometimes we think, well, what did Especially if we've grown up in church. We call people repentance. It's not that big a deal. For many people, it's a very painful For many people, it's a very painful issue. A worldview always has three main aspects. Aspect. Now, these relate to the three main aspects of a person that we've talked about before. Mind so there's an intellectual or cognitive aspect. This is how this is what people think. And even how they think and reason. Then there's also the part of it, a worldview that applies or involves your will. This is 
Sa what it says to us about values and priorities. Ainat hence ay asum es arasna her tutsun neri ye varjek neri. What is good? What is bad? Ishna love, ishna vat. Um, what the what is beautiful and what is ugly? Ishna kevat hik ya ishna tagyak. Have you ever seen European paintings from the Middle Ages? Ishna darits Europa kan karna ta selek hech. All the women are fat. Fat women were beautiful. Why? A lot of people died from hunger in the Middle Ages. And everybody dreamed about being able to eat enough to become fat. So a fat woman, a large woman. That was her. She's good looking. In some cultures, some African cultures, the longer a woman's neck, the more beautiful. Beauty is not an absolute category. What one culture views as beautiful, the other culture says it's not really. Uh, family is a priority. People believe that in Armenian culture? Do they act like that or not? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yes, they do. Some do. Okay. okay. I mean, they, they deceive others so that their children are doing good. Or... Okay. Sometimes may not be the case in Armenia. Sometimes family is more important in the village than in the city. Especially the city people used to not live in that city. American European cities, what happens is young people moving from the rural areas to the city. Their family is a long ways away. So their friends and their co-workers sometimes start to fulfill the function that family used to. And function and got that on whatever means you want to talk about it. And friends and with co-workers. Yeah, um, my wife and I are. Um, I came from a very big family. Yes, meds and panic some girls. But when I thought of family, I mostly thought of mom, dad, and our kid, and their kids. My wife had a much broader idea. Family is mom, dad, kids, dad's brothers and sisters, mom's brothers and sisters, all of all of their kids, all the cousins, and the grandmas and grandpas. So when there would be a holiday, like Christmas, I thought, okay, we'll spend time with our family. My wife was like, no, I have to see my aunts and uncles. Yes, but the whole is, whole corners, and I'm topic Okay, when are we going to see them all? Yeah, I think it's well, on Christmas and... Day. Uh, so it's in I'm like, That's a so we have to go to my mom and to... We're going to have it at our house. We'll go to my mom and dad's house. We'll mom go to your mom and dad's house. Uh, we'll go to and and and see see grandma, grandpa, and all these cousins and... Yes, yes, yes, so we have to do. I went, dear. We live an hour and a half from my mom and dad. And an hour and a half from your mom and dad. So from my mom and dad's house to your mom and dad's house is We're not going to be able to do this in one day. She was like, but we have to. I was like, no, we don't. She was like, no, but that, that's what family is about. And then panic in Chimas in there. And I really wanted to say, you just need to take a knife and cut off some of these family people. You can't do all that. Hanak versus me, kind of stink at rest, come at kids, and so they delete on it. Yeah. She was like, oh, we had to work out this whole thing. 
That's a book show. Bonnie Swish Bet Cash. Which I year do we get to see who and what? I mean, it's horrible. Oh, Dario Lincoln and Ben and Dario. I love Jesus. I He's love just Christmas. Christmas. I hated Christmas Day. Yes, like it. All the mess of the Zenora. Because we were running everywhere. Well, the vase was in the comment. That will have a chat. And that's to make the object in a short car. I have said how much. Dr. Ashur, the hand of Scott's book. Human emotions are pretty universal. Mark Gans Gas, Mukner Universal. Fear, anger, love, hate, envy. Oh, the Luxion, the positive and negative. The Lini, positive, the Dragon, the Dragon, the Queen, the Aspat, the Spite, Star Beritune. Which emotions can you admit? And a foreign covers Gas, Mukner Garas and Tunes for Unes, but the Arab Mashaki match. And how do you express this? He has inch persons are tied to my Gas, Mukner. In some cultures, Varosh Mashak with Neri match. In some cultures, Varosh Mashak with Nerum. When you're mad, you can yell. Aras Goras. Or if you're having a discussion, you can get really loud. Garvas parts are hostess. Italians get loud when they have. Italians get a year for hostmen and parts and hostmen. Interestingly enough, so do Koreans. I took care of Koreans in the man of God. From you from South Korea, that they were very quiet. I found Koreans in the house no shot. A Korean shot at hostmen. Me Koreans that know each other. As well as no humble of Korea, I get them. It ain't look marked. They are they're they're really loud. Shot parts and hostmen. And I just thought they were very quiet. That's not when they relax. It's like they're like a vacuum. And I'm shocked. Oh yeah, so can I check what about them? Okay. Old school. Belarusian Ukrainian culture. Men are never romantic. Never, never, never offended. A beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, hey, you think Chen Nelson? Chen Nelson. They offended me. Mhm. Men never get offended. Yeah, women. I love that. The brothers meeting this one guy. Oh, yeah, for now, yeah, for now. One of the younger guys. Talk about what to do. Like, oh, sorry, man. And Mar and Mustn't change her name. We have make his never son. Yeah, but it can't be done. I don't know, but yes, we have been a perfection now. Can be a work from Kong. Oh, and by the way, I know I have brothers never have to deal with Indy. Yeah, but I'm yet pick not on the hearts. Oh, yet pick barbets and hearts. Okay, so there was a tactic. Yeah, I stopped the gun. You probably don't do this in a minute. But if I'm upset with you, I said, Yes, you're going to have some problem. Sure, problem. I will not speak. Yes, Arakchum Posa. I will speak very slow. Yes, shut down the Kosam. And I will not raise my voice. Oh, Zainus Chambat, shall see. But I can look at you. That's going to I'm kiss. And if I say it in a calm tone. Oh, yeah, yes, yeah, so I'm just going to raise my voice. Chapat, shall see. I can Zainus. say, you are a small master. Or to the fabulous. And if you get offended, I have to do it all. That's the end. That comment. Because I spoke quietly. Or over the years, hung his I spoke calmly. Yes, hung early. Hung his. That's passive aggression. Aggression. Passive aggression. But it was a tactic that men only used with me all the time. Carson, it's Pavel Mart. Carson, Darek, and Pavel Mart. They can't stop talking about me. It's me. You reached out. Yeah, I said when arguments end, aggression begins. So yeah, yeah. For past that, never been shown an aggression as soon. There was also a phrase they would use when they had no more arguments. Me, for as I applied to some carbor past that, shown an aggression. You've given me, Mr. Fred. So all of your arguments for why all of this should be it. I don't want to admit you're right. I'll look at you and say, "Don't tell me you're right." Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't tell me you're right. Don't I know you're right. You know what you this. But I don't want to admit you're right. So I'm just going to say, oh, it's, it's just, you just don't understand. And you're supposed to say, well, maybe that's just, huh? Yeah, it's a mask on him. 
Because you're supposed to get the signal that I don't want to discuss this anymore. Because I don't want to discuss In any culture, there's these little tactics. Yeah, you Can you cry? Was the that men in Armenia in prayer. I know you two or three times in a year. Give them what do us loud. So you cry. Has the same loud salute. When you cry, do other men feel uncomfortable? Yeah, to loud some sort of smart account. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. There's different people. Some people are more. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. The culture gives you a little bit. When can you cry? Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, Carlos. Here, and our worldview really gives us a sense of safety. It helps us pull all these thoughts and all these emotions together into a unified match. So I can make sense of life. Yeah. Um, so far, when you all speak Armenian, I understand almost no words. Yes, good. Except bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. Bites. I think it's something. Oh, okay. It touches the minion. I think it's what it means. Or I'm thinking it is. Yeah. And so that's what. But the rest of it doesn't sound like words. Why? I don't have a system. I don't know your grammar. I can't tell one word. I can't tell one word. Because he's the savior of the world. So to say it's just, uh, your your worldview is like rules of grammar. Uh, it's like an old man. It's a structure of the Now, because of that, when you come with the gospel, and you start telling me things that are very biblical. Yeah, <laughs> but don't match what I've always thought. But how about the sun? Chen, Neran, Inchias, Mishti, Pain. You have disrupted my stability. Duk Im Kainutun Hachtumek. And I have to decide. Yes, but Kabarushan Kaisen. Am I willing to give up this stability? Artakas Uzuma Mikal to the Eskainutun of Drapokhana Veli Lavans. And if I, there's always a pain, you know, there's a pain in coming yeah, to Christ. Uh, it's half coming to Christ, in Galumaj. And while the pain of staying the same, yeah, the yeah, pain from the way your lifestyle present. I think I'm cold. Lost people experience pain. Because of the relationship. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. But there's a pain. But it's got to be coming to Christ. Christ in Galumaj. And as long as the pain is coming to Christ. That the cost and the pain of coming to Jesus is greater than the pain of staying. But when they are so tired, and and they realize there's something better. As long as drug addicts are happy doing drugs, as long as husband and wife like their marriage, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, as long as they can live in the same way, 
And while you're not discontent with what is, We've already talked about these. I love this little picture. Because it's very confusing. It's very good, but it's very confusing. Basically, what it's trying to show you is there are all these apparent or obvious parts of a culture or society. Okay. When I first visited Armenia, what did I notice? Your apartment buildings aren't white. Apartment right. buildings have their shank area, a spit action, car median. You don't have that kind of stuff in the Ukraine buildings. At the Arita Sakish Chalk and Gombe. The texture is pretty much post Soviet. Uh, so, uh, Soviet Akan car and Castle Jatar Petitina, but it's new in Taskachuna. And then, yeah, Hato. I went, they took me to the downtown area and I went yes, down, downtown, Gentron. This is different. As Surish Chatara Petition. We drive around. Oh, there's a culture. And I start noticing the business in a cartel, Tessaneri Banera. Now, I also noticed, and this is this is an overgeneralization. If I took a picture of people in Yerevan, took a picture of people in Poland, took a picture of people in Kiev, more men have dark beards. That's not good or bad, it's just the lab can watch the work to correct it. I can't go back. What you immediately see, and he has dies to me and comes this soon. Cultures have smells. I don't mean that people stay. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Some cultures have spices. Serious smell different than Yerevan. Serious nourish hot owner can Yerevan. Especially around restaurants. A restaurant name of name of name. Definitely. Because it's different spices. I have thought about how many can I? For years. Already know. I don't notice anymore. But what I would notice in Belarus, in Ukraine, and showing that to me Belarus and Ukraine, the smell of garlic. They can't cook without garlic. They eat garlic with garlic. And then you smell garlic. I've not noticed that smell as much. Because you have different spices. And so you notice architecture. You know, you immediately notice language. This doesn't sound like anything I've ever heard. Yes, intro lesson and voice in Bani Namanchi. You know, my first reaction is. You know, are they really speaking the language? Or is that just really? Yes, no, because I'm here. I guess you don't. It's my problems. I'm here in my chapter. Yeah, I said political system. Have ideas. How can can system on an engagement? Yeah, voice engagement. Ask for solution. David, the first time I came was David. Yeah, yeah, for Forever, I will associate your nose with all of this. No, it's ugly. No, it's not. <laughs> also, you know, um, when we moved from Belarus to Ukraine, the faces were a different shape. The Russians have triangles. Russians have triangles. The Ukrainians have ovals. Yeah. It's different because of the and you see how what kind of organization that doesn't say how's my get what's in there and ensuring that you can transport but that's just a very right set on a shot market is in market like you put it um 
If you look at a pomegranate, and you've never eaten a pomegranate, and you look at the outside, do you have any idea what's on the inside? I'd heard of pomegranate. I thought it would be like an orange. That's my opinion. Apelsini nu mana bațumes. Oh, I could enjoy a pomegranate if I did that way. When we try to just change the external, uh, like in ourselves or others, we'll never have the remember what Jesus said? The Pharisees said, clean the outside. Clean the inside. He said, you're like whitewash tombs. You're uh, good. Uh, inside you're full of dead people. Jesus transforms people from the inside to the outside. So, there are churches that the big goal is to make lost people speak and act like Savior. Uh, you shouldn't have those pants on. You shouldn't have cosmetics on. You shouldn't have cosmetics on. You shouldn't have You You You he started reaching kind of the think, uh, uh, more radical, radical people. Radical what people? The informal name of those. The ah, radical, these radical giant that had piercings and tattoos. Piercing their belt on their own neck. And they started getting saved. Yeah, and success in Perkwell. And one of the brothers in the uh, middle uh, said, you need to tell them to take off those piercings out. Piercing their tattoos. But piercing their own neck. Piercing their own neck. Oh, yeah, start in a No, I'm just going to disciple him. Just I'm teaching love Jesus. I'm to teach him to put a piercing in I mean, if he'd been out in the lightning storm and got hit by lightning, he's in his face. He's in his face. He's in his face. He's Came to church, he didn't have anything in his ears. Oh, yeah, he had a month later, he had nothing in his eyebrows. Oh, then said the Artemis Bonnet, and Terry Vrain, and then he had no ears. Oh, Virginia Varanet, Leslie for a piercing. He had no ears. That sounds set of ocean piercing tuner. Why? In show. He was transformed from the inside out. Nurses were a prophet or step doors. But to get to that, by Stran Hasnel Hammer, you have to think about what. You have to think about what are those deeply held beliefs. What are they? And they're sure. How do they make their choices? And how do they deal with emotions? And how do they deal with emotions? And how do they deal with emotions? And how do they deal with emotions? And how do they deal with emotions? We typically, as Protestants in the prefer to start with the mind. We proclaim the word. There's a lot of good But there are some groups of people that if you don't touch their emotions, you get better. Yeah, what I mean by that is you're in the middle. You can just try to inform them. God you can try to teach them the Bible. By reading it, 
and having them if mentally What if I was on the boat? And you, inch can hear that yes, now the message. Yeah, Jesus is stuck in that. You can tell the intellectually. The intellectual carasas. You can never fear because Jesus is near. Carasas, do get packed, but keep walking. So that Jesus is more there. And the most person is going to go. As God's a kind of a casting. New life. What? Well, but if you say, I stay in us. Do want to go there. If you've got water up to your knees, yeah, the jura or the sand nearly that fast. The boat is going side to side. Oh, now we're coming. We're going to see the storm. She does. Yeah, because Puerto Rico is too narrow. And you look over and you see the sea. How would you feel? In in space, this guy. I'm sure you would have just walked on. Oh, what about the hangers? The nurse, Jesus, Jesus. That's that's not that. Yeah, it it just but but my hand on me. You see. ասնակ <gülüyor> It's less probable that they'll make the commitment. Ali kids have not gone to the video. The video is going to be on Jesus. Which one? They are decisive people. They are very, very, very, very energetic. They have a lot of information. And such that when they see a guy, they ask him, "Can you inch by inch?" And they inch by inch. And those kind of people, they may listen to you. Because they are not careful, they are not careful. And if you're not careful, and if you're not careful, what you do with them? Yeah, that they are usually just chest tension. So I'm going to tell you something. And um, and internally, this is what's happening. Um, you know, side there. You're like a salesman. Who keeps showing Fred a telephone? Oh, Fred is showing him all the functions of the telephone. All the functions of the telephone. And he shows him all the the options he's got in that telephone. Switch all the the options he's got in that telephone. Switch that all. And on in short, cut all the functions. Fred has already decided in twenty minutes. Fred has decided to buy all the items. All the items are already in the telephone. And he wants you to stop talking and say how much it costs. So he can decide. The data is considered to assess the charge. And there are some of those decisive people. Yeah, from SPC Martin Khan. Possible that your mayor and that other mayor in town might be in this category. If there are people that in their work and in their life have to make decisions. As Martin Khan said, "We're going to make a decision. We're going to make a decision. We're going to make a decision." Well, you won't expect it. So you do just pass. They're going to say, "Hold on." I'm ready to receive. And he'll be like, "Are you sure?" And I'm like, "Yep." And cousin, how? And you might say, "Well, let me just tell you." Yeah, that's how we're in both sides. That's the nature. That's the cycle. I see. Irons the nature. And I'm going to talk about that. With that value part of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of the Bible, value of այն ինչպես մարտիկ կայս մեր ինձ ասությունները եւ ինչքան արագեն ընդդյուն կայս ոլ իմպակտ կազդի հաու լոնգ իտ նորմալի տեքս ֆրոմ հիերինգ դա գասպել դա ֆրստ ինչքան ժամանակ է պետք իրենց առաջին քամ ավետարանը լսելուց մինչև հիսուսին ընդունելը դեր ար գրուպս ռաունդ դ վորլդ խմբեր կան աշխարհում լայֆ իս շորտ կյանքը կարճ է եւ դա 30 օր 40 եթե 30-ից 40 տարի ապրում ես Afrikaner, Afrikan marka, bu sefer çok zehre. Doğru da bu sefer zehre daha iyi inçen arasında. İnce karasının hastası, inç organizm hastası, mahanım en azından. Marktan şu zaman ne pek çiğ oluşum kaysınlı ham. Bence inkar pes kanan kaysın, ben inkar bak kayın. Mesela varım, mesela ki ne de uzun mesela inç kaysın. Ala portsa sinet sengerler inen şu zaman hambi hastan. Bence inkar ben lisela ve zaman. Karafayın Amerika ama beri kan. Martin Batras then Nisha Patun are actually coming to the table to learn to learn. People that study this, yeah, Martin Carlos, some are in missiolog, nera Christian anthropolog, nera Martha Ban, nera Asuman. If you can find out, that the car will get nailed. How long people typically? Lord, best canon, inch canon, Martin, matatsum. A major decision in life. 
իրենց կյանքում մեծ որոշում կարծում եմ հասցնում Okay. <laughs> How long was it from the first time that you clearly started that you were a sociologist, and the source of the heart is the heart. And all the answers are somewhere in the neighborhood of the heart. You know what the sociologists are saying? You know what the sociologists are saying? Er <laughs> Sociology, sociology to me is more of an objective science than psychology. Sociology and Imamar are objective What they're saying about how different age groups in Romania. Right, in Chennai, in the person the the the the the the the Based on the worldview, if I will love Gapa, Garma, Cosmo, extensive research in America. At that time, how many times did you hear the gospel? How many people that came straight from the world? How many times do you think the, the average person said? More than five times? Or, or Who thinks more than five? Who thinks less than five? Typical answer is seven times. Um, and then some of the church leaders said that we are making a big mistake. We think we can share the gospel once or twice. And and say, we just haven't heard of it in the past. This is a gross illustration. Yes, I'm going to 
Probably now. That's when Rachista Maxima Chagino. Back up into the mouth. Head them there, and it goes back to stomach number two. Head Yerko Stamok Sagino. That's what happens in the process of evangelism. I'll change at the Terran and the Tower Times and the Nasi Cover and by stomach as an Arachista Snake of Chair. They hear it. Ali Lusunan. They forget it. Moratan. They come back and think about it again. I think I'll be selling about the Terran Massin. It would, it would be fascinating. Maybe next time I can go up with you. It would be fascinating for me to see in, in the village. Uh, Father Gyokunan, you're from your son, come come. And try to figure out who influences who. Over browse the tsunami. Over browse the tsunami. You sometimes will see. Yeah, come to best thing. Lord Damartner, Don Mitch, or something. Yeah, Vincent is just But you'll say something. That's an insurance bank. Kina Havanam, your husband needs to see. I'm not so much a mess, not a bit of a business. He knows. Open your ears, but I can't consider a bad singer. Or some grandma will go. I'm sure it's all because that means that applies to you. That's a bit of a bit of a bit of a bit of physical dynamics, physical, physical kind of dynamic. I'm not telling you have to become a sociologist. But you have to become a student of people. Right, Mark Gans, Usano Vespas, or Jesus, no, Jesus, and the God, that's Mark. That doesn't mean that his eyes just happen to follow him. Why do you see him? Because he's a good person. Why do you see him? Because he's a good person. And they have, may not have been the first time that he's a good person. May not have been the first time that he's a good person. Jesus and I, it's not so. He's teaching that, that place for a little while. He's sorry. Ten years ago, I want to get the sore as no. That time, he intentionally looked. I just want to get the sore as no. And Hovland is looking intently at me and saying, We better pray. Thank you, Father.